Autodesk Inventor 2019 features significant performance improvements in parts, assemblies, and drawings. In the assembly environment, you'll see immediate gains as you zoom, pan, and rotate your model. And there are times when it's helpful to edit your subassemblies in place at the main level. You'll notice considerable time savings as you enter and exit the edit mode. Section views can also come in handy when working on internal portions of your design. Performing a section view on a large assembly in the past may have seemed like a daunting task. This is not a problem in the Inventor 2019 release. Drag the arrow to position the section and see the results instantaneously. There are several other noteworthy improvements for area selection and selecting component patterns. Rebuild all in switching between positional representations and level of detail. That's just a few of the many enhancements you'll see in assemblies. Now let's take a look at drawings. Creating base and projected views is faster than ever. Navigate view orientation using the view cube and preview changes on the fly. Once the views have been placed, it takes less time to compute them, allowing you to quickly get started on the rest of the drawing. We all know that design and engineering is about change. Modifications to your assembly reflect in the drawing in less time. All the performance enhancements in the Inventor 2019 release have been made so you can get more done in less time. Autodesk Inventor continues to improve on automation in the 2019 product. In this release, there are new iLogic assembly functions making it easier for you to write code to add, modify, and delete components and constraints. In this conveyor assembly, we're deleting and adding the chute to an assembly along with three constraints to fully define its position. What does that look like in the role editor? Here, we have a simple logic statement to either remove or add the chute. Below that, there are three constraints. There are dozens of new assembly functions listed in the snippet column on the left. They're divided into three categories of assembly components, relationships, and positioning. Adding them to the rule editor is simple. Double click on an object such as a flush constraint and modify the text for the name of the mate, component name, and referencing geometry. In this case, we use planes for the constraints, but if you're interested in using part geometry like faces or edges, not a problem in the Inventor 2019 release. In this assembly, we're using iLogic functions to add or remove the casters. Notice the added caster at the bottom of the browser along with an insert constraint to position each one. As you know, an edge is used in this constraint type. The question is, how do you get the edge name in the rule editor? New in Inventor 2019, you can now assign names directly to geometry. Right click any face or edge and provide a name. This makes it easier than ever to identify specific areas of the model in the rule editor. Here, we can see it's simply a matter of typing in the name of the geometry for the insert constraint. The new iLogic assembly functions in Autodesk Inventor 2019 improve the way you configure your designs and automate your processes. Model-based definition tools in Autodesk Inventor allow you to dimension, annotate, and tolerance your 3D models. The Tolerance Advisor built into Inventor now allows you to display the constraint state of all surfaces. You can now quickly identify right on the model what surfaces are fully or partially constrained, unconstrained, and even surfaces that are constrained by a general surface profile. This enhancement along with existing MBD tools help ensure your 3D models meet manufacturing specifications for downstream consumption. The hole and thread note now automatically display pattern quantities similar to the tolerance feature. Model-based definition tools in Autodesk Inventor 2019 help you quickly and accurately document your 3D designs. In a modern design and engineering environment, engineers need to collaborate with other project stakeholders. Autodesk Inventor 2019 includes a simple and secure method for working together as a team on visual representations of the model from any location on any device. It's called Shared Views and is available to customers on subscription. Once a view has been shared, collaborators have several ways to review the model with section views, measure capabilities, and even exploded assemblies with a simple drag of your mouse. Use markup tools to redline the design or add notes and comments directly to specific areas of the model. This can all be accomplished without installing a single Autodesk product. All markups and comments are posted to the panel on the right, making it easy for you to review the thoughts and considerations from other team members. Notifications are also sent via email as collaborators submit feedback. 
also within the panel, you'll notice a link to share the view with others for feedback. This again can be accessed from any device such as a mobile phone or tablet. All the same features and functions are available. Clicking on previous comments take you directly to the same orientation, exploded, or section view. All feedback is up to date for everyone to review, whether you're in the Autodesk Viewer or even in the Shared Views panel with an inventor. Using Autodesk Shared Views in Inventor 2019 is a more effective way to communicate and collaborate with key stakeholders. The whole command in Autodesk Inventor 2019 has been totally overhauled to make the creation and placement of holes faster, smarter, and more robust. The first thing you'll notice is the user interface has been streamlined to reduce picks, clicks, and mouse movements, making the creation of one hole or ten holes faster than ever. You no longer must choose what type of hole you want to create. Inventor automatically changes placement type based on your interaction with the model. In-context editing and fast linear dimensioning make creating more than one hole easy without the need to create the sketch first. Inventor creates the underlying sketch for you automatically and switching between the whole feature and the sketch is a simple click. This combines two previously separate processes into one streamlined workflow. The new whole feature allows users to create personalized presets to further automate the whole creation process and give you the freedom to choose how you want to organize and use presets. The new whole command in Autodesk Inventor 2019 helps streamline and speed your 3D modeling process. Sheet Metal on Autodesk Inventor 2019 adds user request and enhancements from Inventor Ideas and enhanced corner relief options. The Face command in Inventor 2019 now supports a mid-plane offset. This user request and enhancement is helpful when sheet metal faces need to meet up or fall on a mid-plane for assembly fit-up purposes. Previous workflows required additional work planes to create this type of placement. Laser Weld has also been added to the corner relief shape. This allows you to create corner reliefs that terminate with a tangent arc. This relief option provides more suitable flat patterns for laser cut parts. New sheet metal options in Autodesk Inventor 2019 help you model the way you want and provide more manufacturing options. Autodesk Inventor 2019 includes productivity enhancements and improved performance for assemblies. Let's take a look at a few of them, starting with tube and pipe. You can now define and lock the hose length for your route. This can be done in the edit dialog box or add dimensions manually to the spline if desired. This enables you to accurately calculate the exact sum of hose length for downstream documentation. This ensures the length will work when making modifications to your design. What if the hose is connected to a moving component? The specified length will remain unchanged as adaptive components are moving in the assembly. There's also enhancements made to constraints. The insert constraint is great for defining all degrees of freedom besides rotation. Now, in Inventor 2019, you can lock the rotation of a component as well with a single click in the checkbox. This saves the time it would normally take to add a coincident or angular constraint to fully define its position. Next, the place constraint provides three new solutions for constraining two axes. Use the new positions for opposed and aligned to control the axis position the way you want. Be sure to watch the video on performance improvements to find out more about what's been done in assemblies for Inventor 2019. Part modeling tools in Autodesk Inventor 2019 add more robust direct editing and Inventor Ideas submissions. Direct editing is a great option when modifying non-native data in an AnyCAD workflow or if you're just looking to quickly edit your model. Inventor 2019 now supports automatic blending when using direct edit. Automatic blending moves adjacent tangential faces and creates new blends if required. This works when moving or rotating faces. The new inverted fillet option allows you to create convex fillets on an inside edge or create concave fillets on an outside edge. This inventor idea submission eliminates the need for you to create additional sketches and features. Whether you're editing parts in an AnyCAD workflow or adding edge treatments to your 3D models, Inventor 2019 provides the tools to help you work more efficiently.